Welcome to our exploration of the symbol Zeta and its fascinating history in the world of mathematics. The symbol Zed represents the set of all integers, positive numbers, negative numbers, and zero. In mathematical notation, we write this as shown here. But where did this symbol come from, and why do we use it? The notation Z comes from the German word Zahlen, meaning numbers. This usage was popularized in the early 20th century by German-speaking mathematicians. The use of Z to denote integers was popularized by the Bourbaki group, a collective of primarily French mathematicians who aimed to reformulate mathematics on an extremely abstract and formal basis. This group was active during the mid-20th century and had a significant influence on modern mathematical notation. One of the key figures in this adoption was David Hilbert, among others, who contributed significantly to modern algebra and number theory. Z is a part of a family of symbols known as blackboard bold or double-struck letters used to represent different sets of numbers, like N for natural numbers and R for real numbers. Here are some fun facts about this symbol. Did you know that the Bourbaki group, who popularized the use of Z, isn't a real person? The name Nicholas Bourbaki was actually a nickname for this group of mathematicians. They chose this fictional identity to publish their works under a single, unified name. The integers are part of a larger mathematical universe. For example, the symbol Z is often seen alongside Q for rational numbers, R for real numbers, and C for complex numbers. Each of these symbols helps mathematicians quickly communicate complex ideas. Integers and the symbol Z play foundational roles in various fields, from computer science, where integers are a basic data type, to physics and engineering, where they're used in numerous calculations and theories. So, next time you see the symbol Z, You'll know it's not just a random choice, but a nod to the German word for numbers and a testament to the collaborative spirit of mathematicians. Thanks for watching. Stay curious, stay sharp, and keep solving the mysteries of math.